Well, with the Ebola threat seeming to grow, a Philadelphia area company has been called to duty in Dallas. They have a decontamination robot used to clean up after a patient there died. Here on your side, health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here with an exclusive look at this amazing technology. Yeah, interesting Philadelphia connection here. Stopping the spread of the deadly Ebola virus is proving to be a difficult task. Well, a biotech company based here has equipment at that Dallas hospital that it says will make the hospital safer after Ebola patients are treated. This is a, a control panel. Decontamination robots like this are being used in the Dallas hospital trying to contain the Ebola infection. It sprays a hydrogen peroxide vapor that can kill viruses and other germs. When it introduced into a sealed room, we'll uh, get in every nook and cranny in the room. And when it comes out of saturation, it envelopes the bacteria that's in the room and kills it. Ed Stryevsky is the director of operations at BioQuell based in Horsham, Montgomery County. The nozzles spin both uh, 360 each way, uh, so it will ensure uh, equal distribution of the vapor in the room. He says the remote controlled robotic sterilization systems have been used in a variety of places, including the NIH and Johns Hopkins. Here you see a room being taped to seal it for the hour long decontamination. Now, similar robots from BioQuell are in Dallas following the death of Thomas Eric Duncan. We uh, sterilized the suite of rooms that he was uh, exposed in. Currently this week, uh, we are back down there working in the emergency rooms. BioQual says research shows hydrogen peroxide vapor can sterilize locations, which reduces the risk of people contracting contagious diseases. The company says the technology is a quick and safe way for hospitals to contain Ebola. We have been preparing for uh, an outbreak such as this for the last three, four months. Now, BioQuell says it uses a verification system, including chemical test strips that are taped to the wall to ensure that the contaminants have been eliminated and that it is safe to enter the room. This technology could be a big help in this yeah. outbreak. Amazing. Yeah. Every, every little bit of contribution helps in this fight, no doubt. Steph, thank you very mm -hmm. much.